Is this is this the the yes, this is T's Three Pointers TV. I'm here with an Arsenal fan. Is this your son? Yeah, man. Yeah. yeah? What's your name, man? Chris. Chris. Chris All right, nice to meet you, Chris and Josh. Josh. Yeah, big up. Listen, man, what did, what did you think of today's result, man? Amazing, man. It's more, it's more about what's happened over the last 18 months. The vibe energy from the fans is needed mm. you hear all the stuff from social media it just builds up just weak propaganda the fact that everyone's now behind the club behind the team is exactly what we need and they're ballers and zinchenko jesus exactly what we needed like, it's mad to even have them on the field but i'm happy i'm happy glad you're mentioning that because this time last season we lost against chelsea exactly. how did you feel this time last year about Arteta? For me, I'm, uh, like, I, I was always Wenger, raised, raised through Wenger, okay. same, same philosophy. So to see someone come in who was trying to shape the culture, and we can see that now, he's shifted everything. So, so But the question is, how did you feel about Arteta? Was, you Arteta, were you, was it Arteta out? I'm a long-term thinker. Everything <laughs> I do is always long-term. So you have to give people that time to let show, like, to show improve, and he's done that. He's done let me, that. Let, so. me, let me ask you something. What did you think of Arteta this time last year? What I mean, what were you thinking? Were you thinking, you know what? He needs to go. We need another manager. I, I think he needed time, but when I think we scraped a win against Norwich, I think obviously the win was good, but it was Norwich, and to win one nil, it wasn't like that it's convincing. Really, yeah, they needed that, and then they built momentum after that, didn't they? But um, yeah, fast forward, let's just talk about now actually because we've got, I uh, understand we've got Bournemouth, Fulham and Aston Villa. I don't know if it's in that order, but I know they're the next three games. If we The next home match is Fulham, one's at the 27th I think it is, and Bournemouth away. So yeah, big games, as much as people are expecting the wins, every game is hard in the Prem. So you just got to make sure the team are out there, the fans are supporting, which is key. And we'll get them wins, get yep. them wins, get them points on the board. That's what it's about right now, man. They were charting away today, weren't they? Amazing, amazing. The energy. <laughs> like, we've been coming, I don't know. I since... believe in Jesus. Yes. I believe Yes. <laughs> believe, man. All the Gabbies, so every, <laughs> all of them, man. They're just amazing. But, um, yeah, what was I saying now? Yeah, so over the last seven years that he's been coming here to see the, the energy. That's all I want to see is just positive energy from the fans because they don't understand and they are understanding now how much of a difference it makes. Right. So yeah, man, we keep going, we keep winning. Gunners for life. Nice, big up. That's it. I think we ended on that one, bro. Thank you, brother. Nice That's one. one. Big up. Right. Cheers, man. Come on, peeps. What were you waiting for? Like, share, subscribe to the Three Pointers.